show number 39. Can you believe it? 39 shows. have superpowers and now this whole world you guys out there it's all my imagination i'm dreaming it i made it up even even cheryl and even cheryl andrews proprietor of cheryl andrews designs cheryl entertainment entertainment well that's why we're here tonight entertainment entertainment I'm gonna make you feel all right. We're gonna have a million laughs. Ha <laughs> ha! We'll have tons of fun. And then I saw a girl in half. <laughs> There'll be drinks for everyone. Entertainment! Entertainment. I'm gonna make you feel all right. Grab a tiger by the paws, stick my head into its mouth, and then I'll bask in your applause. So put your hands together. Well, that's why we're here tonight. Entertainment, real life entertainment. I'm gonna make you feel all right. People sleeping in the streets. There's sadness, hate, and pain. Some folks don't have enough to eat. But who cares as long as we're entertained? Entertainment! Ah! We're here tonight. Entertainment, entertainment. I'm gonna make you feel all right. Entertainment, entertainment. Well, that's why we're here tonight. Entertainment, my little cinematic universe entertainment. I'm gonna make you feel all right. Entertainment, entertainment. Well. Entertainment, I'm gonna make you feel, make you feel, make you feel all right. Welcome to my show! I am feeling good tonight. I've imagined all of you. And I'm playing a song for Mr. Bruce Shower, ladies and gentlemen. While the college girls downstairs play their music too loud. And they're always knock, knock, knocking at our door. They got a yapping little dog, and dogs are not allowed. And I don't think I can take it anymore. Upstairs, it sounds like someone's sink is overflow. And the water's drip, drip, dripping on the floor. It's enough to make a torture victim's head explode. And I don't think I can take it anymore. I can take it anymore. I just want to get a good night's sleep. I don't want to lie here counting sheep. But as it is, I'll probably go insane watching the little red numbers change. Maybe you can sleep through all the noise out there. But the siren screaming song I can't ignore. We gotta get out of here, let's fly away somewhere. Cause I don't think I can take it anymore. No, I don't think I can take it I'll probably lose my mind 
watching the sun peep through the blinds. Maybe you can sleep through all the noise out there. But the siren screaming song I can't ignore. We got to get out of here. Let's fly away somewhere. Surprise, Arizona. Because I don't think I can take it anymore. Because I don't think I can take it anymore. No, I don't think I can take it anymore. I don't think I can take it any. Don't think I can take it any. Don't think I can take it anymore. Woo! Another week, another 45 requests. This week I'm doing some requests that I held over from the last two weeks, but not this one. This one, of course, is for Miss Nikki Schroeder. Schroeder, I pronounced your last name correctly. But more importantly, Jan Thompson out there in San Diego, it's your birthday. And your lovely husband, Doug, oh, he loves you so much he wants me to sing. I guess one of the most romantic songs I ever wrote. So, Jan? Well, I don't know much, but I can see that I love you and you love me. We didn't plan this out. It was luck, and we don't make love. We just circle around the bed wearing wicked smiles with our clothes in every corner of the room. Hope that we can be together soon. Oh, in, my, in my world that I've conjured from my head. Right now I see Jan and Doug. They're already in bed. Covers pulled up to here. And I'm singing to both of them, I guess. Well, uh, Speed fast, the music slow. I got my high, 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 and the lights down low. You say, Come here, daddy, and kiss me quick. I touch your hand, and you touch my heart like no one else has ever touched me before. And soon you're wearing nothing but perfume. I hope that we can be together soon, be together soon. Together soon, be together soon. Jen. Jen. Because when you're not here, I feel lost. I got my doors wide open and my fingers crossed. Not here. I can't wait. I take a long hot bath and I master French and Italian and a little bit of Greek. I write a lovely poem about the moon. I hope that we can be together soon. 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 We'll be together soon. We'll be together soon. We'll We'll be together soon. Oh, guys. You can tell what a good mood I'm in. I got, I got plans for the rest of the night. I'm going to do a kick-ass show with some hard songs in it. Then my... My prodigal son Julian is home from college. Get up here and make an appearance. He's dressed like the guy who sits at the counter at Bob's Burgers. Drinking a beer already. I thought you had schoolwork to do. We're going to watch uh, the finale of WandaVision. Then we might watch a little Warrior. Oh. There, especially Sheila Finnamore out there in Maine. I'm happy if you're happy, if you're happy, everybody's happy. Come on now, though it's true. 
one more time. I'm telling you, I'm happy. If you're happy. If you're happy, everybody's happy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know it's true. Listen, Sheila, because I'm telling you, imagine the worst that could happen. Multiply it by nine. Imagine society crumbling. Put it out of your mind. I'm happy if you're happy. If you're happy, everybody's happy. Come on now, you know it's true. One more time, I'm telling you. I'm happy if you're happy. If you're happy, everybody's happy. Come on, George, you know it's true. Listen, buddy, cause I'm telling you. Imagine the world's getting hotter. The temperature continues to climb. Durham, Maine is covered with water. Put it out of your mind. I'm happy if you're happy. If you're happy, everybody's happy. Come on now, you know it's true. One more time, I'm telling you, I'm happy if you're happy, if you're happy, everybody's happy. Yeah, 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 you know it's true. Listen, Julian, because I'm telling you, everyone's hiding their head in the sand. They're all decided to make other plans. So let's have a party, invite eight friends. I sing this song over and over again. I'm happy if you're happy, if you're happy, everybody's happy. Come on now, you know it's true. One more time, I'm telling you. I'm happy if you're happy, if you're happy, everybody's happy. Yeah, 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 you know it's true. Listen, Sheila, cause I'm telling you, I'm happy if you're happy, if you're happy, everybody's happy. And Elliot Falk is six years old! I got a reason to live. To wake up every day, put on these fashionable clothes, and go on my merry way. I got a reason to do the crazy things that I do. I got a reason to live, oh, Elliot. It's you, you, you. Yeah, it's you, you, you. I got a reason to live, to face the world with a smile. I wish that everyone could stand in my shoes for a while. I like to sing in the rain, dance down the avenue. I got a reason to live. Oh, Kate, it's you, you, you. Yeah, it's you, Kate, you. Just a hopeless dreamer, yeah, that's my story. Is that an electric eel? No, that's a more. To sit here and mope. Nope. If at the end of the day you're at the end of your rope, 
then you should end up with me. I think it's time that you do. I got a reason to live. Oh, everybody, it's you, you, you. Yeah, it's you, you, you. I got a reason to live, and it's Patty. I got a reason to live. Oh, Michael Falk, you too. I got a, I got a, I got a reason to live, and it's you. Thank you for watching, if you're watching. Got a lot of nice messages this week. A lot of nice donations. And who, pray tell, who, pray tell, is working this show tonight? Well, seeing as I only let seven other people in this house. One of them is on sound right now, Mr. Pipe Jim, ladies and gentlemen, Pipe Jim. A little fanfare for Pipe, that's what this chord is. We got Mr. Brian Murphy, Mr. Brian Murphy on Jack of All Trades. That's not. Is that a, is that a Bruno Koschmeider? Oh, it's Udo Dirkschmeier. Who else is here with us tonight? Well, it wouldn't be a show without the ever handsome Kevin Hansen. The ever handsome Kevin Hansen. Unfortunately, he will not be playing guitar on the show tonight. The ratings will go way down. We saw Julian already. He's not doing anything but drinking beer tonight, okay? Uh, after a, a long week of having classes at home and, and flipping burgers at Five Guys in Madison. Bobo, let's hear for Bobo, ladies and gentlemen. Can you see him down there? So, you know I'm in the middle of the show. You can't put your tennis ball at my feet and expect me to play with it. Hey, how's this? There we go. Whoa, whoa, whoa. There you go. And last but not least, let us introduce the one who keeps the glasses full. It's not that difficult. We have a limited crew. We have a bubble, ladies and gentlemen. And into the bubble become, comes Miss Bethany McCurdy, the mistress of alcohol. Oh, our drinking word. Let me, let me fix a hip replacement. We can do something again to, we can, we can read the entire bill. All right, there we go, there we go, that's enough. That's a, oh, you know what though? You know what I'm back into? Why don't we have the drinking word be Jeopardy? And every time I either say Jeopardy or sing, -na 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 -na, what is, who is the mistress of alcohol? <laughs> My life's in jeopardy. Let's have it. Let's hear it. Come on. The mistress of alcohol, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you. All the way out in Boston, Massachusetts. As a guy who sends me devilishly complicated requests. All right, Paul Jones. Pick it up, drop it, go on, stop it, baby, don't you know you should, do whatever makes you feel good, save it up, bet it, let it ride, regret it, baby, don't you know you should, do whatever makes you feel good. You should stop for a second, reckon why you always feel so bad. Look outside, it's a sunny day. You don't want to work your whole life away. Come with me and it'll be okay. So let it go. Grab it. You're not a turtle, you're a rabbit. Baby, don't you know you should. Do whatever makes you feel good. Baby, don't you know you should. Do whatever makes you feel good. Baby, don't you know you should. Do whatever makes you feel good. Baby, don't you know you should. Do whatever makes you feel good. Baby, don't you know you should. Do whatever makes you
don't you know you should do whatever makes you feel good you should stop for a second reckon why you always feel so sad look outside it's a sunny day you don't want to work your whole life away Come with me, it might be okay. So pick it up, drop it, go on, stop it. Baby, don't you know you should do whatever makes you feel good. Baby, don't you know you should do whatever makes you feel good. Baby, don't you know you should. Do whatever makes you feel good. Paul Jones, ladies and gentlemen. And then we go to Madison, Wisconsin. I got a little, I got a donation from a woman named Savannah who lives in Madison, Wisconsin. And she says, consider this a little bribe for the song Canadian Porn. Savannah, I don't need a bribe from you because I'm a sucker for Savannah, which could be the title of a sitcom or the name of a band. You name it, Savannah, I'm playing it. A handsome guy, his beautiful wife are living in Quebec. He's a blonde who never smiles, and he's an architect who goes to Toronto on a business trip and meets a femme fatale wearing business casual. She's the CEO of a big Canadian company. In the boardroom, she puts her hand upon the architect's knee bike back to her house and she takes off her khaki skirt they take separate showers first Canadian porn I can't stop watching it Canadian porn hotter than you'll admit Canadian porn wild as it can be Makes me twitch, makes me tingle. All the moaning is bilingual. Very an expletive sworn. Canadian porn. Back in Quebec, he and his wife have a dinner party for their friends. The wine is flowing, the tension growing, the heat is rising there. They get up from the table, kiss each other on both cheeks. He's just not giving up today, is he? Man, it makes your heart go weak. Canadian porn, I can't stop watching it. Canadian porn, hotter than you'll admit. Canadian porn, wild as it can be. Makes me twitch, makes me tingle. All the moaning is bilingual. Nary an expletive sworn. Canadian porn, I can't stop watching it. Canadian porn, hotter than you'll admit. Canadian porn, wild as it can be. Never greasy or obscene. You can watch it while you eat poutine. Maybe a little popcorn. Canadian porn. There's nary an expletive sworn. Nary a bodice is torn. Nary a region is shorn. From evening until early morn. Canadian porn. Canadian porn, I can't stop watching it. Sucker for Savannah. And then, and then there was Mauricio. 
always comes up with good requests. Always sends a nice donation. This week, his donation is supposed to go towards canceled Dr. Seuss books. Don't worry, the ones they canceled are the sucky ones. Mauricio, you remember this song. If I wasn't drunk, mister, you'd be in trouble. If I wasn't drunk, buddy, you'd be afraid. If I wasn't loaded, if I wasn't strung out, I'd reach in your head and rip your tongue out. I'd teach you a lesson, oh yes I would. I'd teach you a lesson and you'd learn it good. If I wasn't drunk, If I wasn't drunk, baby, you'd be my girlfriend. If I wasn't drunk, I'd have a life. If I wasn't loaded, I would jump on your body. Your boyfriend couldn't stop me, cause I know karate. I would teach him a lesson, oh yes I would. I'd teach him a lesson and he'd learn it good. I wasn't drunk. These are the days of wine and roses, Saturday night of a lost weekend. If I wasn't drunk, you know I would miss hanging around with losers like you. On Facebook's like this, if I wasn't loaded, if I wasn't crispy, if I wasn't toasted, teary eyed and misty, I might put on my bottle, I put on my beer, I put on my coat and get out of here if I wasn't drunk. If I wasn't drunk. If I wasn't drunk, na 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 na. Who is Dan Needles? <laughs> who, who donated to this show tonight? And the clue would be a lot of people. Let's go through, let's go through some of the couples. The, the first part is couples who donated to this show. Mark and Julie Degner. Matt and Amy Hendrickson from Venezia, California. Dan and Lisa Elias. Lisa and Jim Hansen from Germantown. Ach, du lieber. Oh, what the hell was that? Tom and Susan Popovics, ladies and gentlemen, uh, down there in Chicago. Jessica and Josh Zilmer in, in honor of their best friend, Austin Slauson. And I think everyone knows how much I love Austin Slauson. Never met him, but I love that name. Uh, Peggy and Steve Brenner in a Conwalk. Hello, Peggy. Hello, Steve. Mike Lemkuhl. Lemkuhl. <laughs> I probably got it wrong this week. And Heidi Frist. Tim and Susan Griffin in Asheville, North Carolina. Thank you. Pam and Corey Melkars. Pam, of Corey, of course, proprietor of Clark Graphics. And he got his first shot this week. Let's hear it for Corey's First Shot, which is an also a great band name. Let's hear for my band, Corey's First Shot. Bruce and Sylvia Haraldson, thank you so much. And Kelly and Emerson Kuss from Raleigh, North Carolina. Thank you, couple. Vicki McBride, every week I hear from you, and you didn't, I don't think I have a request for you this week. So I better, you came in too late, I better just sing a little song called Vicki McBride, Vicki McBride. 
I hadn't met Bethany, you might be my bride, Vicki McBride. Amanda Palavsik and Ann Shower Jimenez, Bruce and Nancy's daughter, says, share the red vines, mom and dad, share the red vines. Casey Bondi, I'm not doing your request, but I'll do... Well, if it seems like I've stopped breathing, don't worry, ma'am. If it seems like I'm always sleeping, that's because I am. Don't wake me up, Carrie Bondi. Don't wake me up. Give me money and fill my cup, but don't wake me up. Thank you, Carrie. Josh and Jenny down there in Kenosha wanted me to play spring cleaning. Well, let me just say, where I live, here in Whitefish Bay, Wisconsin, it has been in the lower 30s all week. I thought maybe we could get back in the garage. Back in the garage again. But then I took my dog for a walk at about 5 o'clock, and my nose was frozen. So she said, I think it's time for some spring cleaning. And threw all my belongings on the lawn. Well, then she said, I'd like to do some home improvement. And by summertime, I was gone. Thank you, Josh and Jenny. The Giffords, the Giffords in Massachusetts. Giffords, give me a different request. I can't do Thankless Blast Bastard every week. Paul Hansen and Karen Reiner, my, my Whitefish Bay neighbors of north of Silver Spring. Ooh. I live south of Silver Spring, or SS, S. Those northern people, I don't know. Thank you, Paul and Karen. Uh, Matthew Iwanicki, you're a new name. David Plonka, a new name. Thank you so much, David. Monica Hall, Jared Finger, 38 for 38, Jared Finger. Uh, yeah, the Sullivans down in Alabama. Jerry Wilkinson, for some reason I looked at that name, Jerry Wilkinson, I thought maybe one of the Spice Girls was donating to my show. But it isn't. Joe Williams, another new name. Chris Hyden out there in, in, on the west part of Wisconsin. Angela Van Ginkle, Daniel McGlynn, Eric Svensson, and Ken Saffron from Little Shoot. Derek Mosier. Derek, your CDs will be on their way on Monday. Elizabeth Gallinger. You know I love that name. Jennifer Puente. And happy birthday to Russ Lipka from Jacqueline Paulson. My wife, Jacqueline. I'm Donald Stewart. Eric Peterson lives in Washington, D.C., and his friend Michael Finley says happy birthday. Beth Swickert, or Sweekert, happy birthday. Melissa Romanesco, Dashiell Young, Dashiell Young. I'm nude, you're nude, we're gonna have a new party. And uh, happy birthday to everybody, and I hate to change the tone of thank you, but there's a guy who came to see my show many, many times. He's a guy who was floating around in Lake Geneva once when I played on a barge. He was a guy who came to my show in, in Milwaukee with his buddies, and I took him to the encore after the show. <laughs> I'm talking about Brian Herbert. He passed away. Too young, way too young. He was a great guy, a great music fan. And the rest of the show is dedicated to Brian. At his service... My bobblehead showed up, and his brothers sang sex and beer. So that was about as, as touching a, a tribute as you could give me. No one is going to do that for me. But guess who else is back in the fold? Jeff and Sarah Briganti from Erie, Colorado. Congratulations on getting another job, Jeff. least I can do is give you this song. Well, you fumbled in the foyer with a lawyer. Then you kissed your psychiatrist. You cooked off your clothes and jumped into a fountain with a certified public account. You took a gift from a Greek every day last week, and you ran your hands up and down his Greek physique. Thousand times, why don't you love me? I'm not so how did I try? Oh, why? A thousand times, why? Hey! Then 
You were off to the races with a racist. Holding hands with a handyman. You went to an ice cream social with an ice cream socialist. I got a love so true and it waits for you. But I can't get in and I can't get through to you. Why, why a thousand times? Why don't you love me? No matter how hard that I try. Oh, why a thousand times? Why? Why don't you love me? I'm not such a horrible guy. Oh, why? A thousand times why? A thousand times why? A thousand times why? Little love song requested by Ms. Patty D. I always forget that this is one of my favorite songs. This and Jeopardy by Greg Kim. What would be my favorite movie? Ashley Judd in Double Jeopardy. One of my favorites. We're holding hands like a Hallmark greeting card. Walking on the beach in slow motion. I feel your heart. I can feel it beating hard, just like mine. It feels so fine. We've got a reasonable facsimile of love. We love all day, and we love all night. We've got a reasonable facsimile of love. Almost real, but not quite. We look real nice, just like movie stars. Got a nice house. Filled with real nice furniture, but just once or twice. Let's find out who we are. Throw away the script and talk all night. We've got a reasonable facsimile of love. We love all day and we love all night. We've got a reasonable facsimile of love. Almost real. But not quite. La da 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 holding hands like the picture on a condom pack when it gets cold we wear big sweaters your well laid plans now you tell me that you want them back but it's too late can't turn back now we've got a reasonable facsimile of love we love all day and we love all night Reasonable facsimile of love. It's almost real, but not quite. La da 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 da
what kind of idiot promises people he will write them a new song every week? This one. The pressure is, is tremendous. Hope you like it. It's been a dark and dismal year, but things are getting better. And we've been smiling through the tears, but things are getting better. The witch is dead, the monster's gone, and things are getting better. It's time to greet the brand new dawn, because things are getting better now. Things are getting better than they ever were before. Peace and love and happiness wait right outside your door. So put a smile back on your face, cause things are getting better. No time to lose, no time to waste, cause things are getting better. Tired, but things are getting better. Your car smashed up, your house on fire. But things are getting better. The glow of youth, it fades so fast. But things are getting better. There might be hope for you at last. Cause things are getting better now. Things are getting better. Cause they can't get any worse Keep all your receipts Because you might get reimbursed And put a smile back on your face Cause things are getting better No time to lose, no time to waste Cause things are getting better now They're getting better now They're getting better getting better. All right, Mark Kunkel. You know I do your request almost every time you send one. I haven't played this one in a little, quite a long time. Well, I gotta have a drug deal, gotta have a car chase, gotta have some violence. Gotta have a happy ending, gotta have some hijinks, non-stop nonsense. Cause my life just gets more boring as my expectations rise. You see nothing when you look into my eyes. Television ruined my television, ruined my television, ruined my life. Television ruined my television, ruined my television, ruined my life. Television ruined my television, ruined my television, ruined my life. Hey! What have I been watching lately? Well, WandaVision. Of course, I'm back on the Jeopardy train. Ah, what is a hip replacement? That would be under potent potable. But listen. Well, I gotta have a love boat, gotta have a... Well, I gotta have a love boat, gotta have a soul train, gotta have my mother the car. Gotta have a talk show cooking in a walk show, gotta have a Hollywood star. My life just gets so stupid, and there's not much I can do without you. Everybody knows it's true. Television ruined my television, ruined my television, ruined my life. Sing! Television ruined my television, ruined my television, ruined my life. And I can't change the Well, I hopped on stage full of passion and rage. I was in my prime. But the hip little boys and the hip little girls were bored out of their minds. Because they need the kind of thrills they only get on Instagram. 
TikTok, just like you. You don't believe I rock. Television ruined my television, ruined my television, ruined my life. Television ruined my television, ruined my television, ruined my life. Television ruined my television, ruined my television, ruined my life. Television ruined my television, ruined my television, ruined my life. Television ruined my television, ruined my television, ruined my life. Mark Hunkel! How are these two songs thematically linked? Well, television ruined my life in the first one. And then John and Veronica Lampy ruined my life for the second one. I did a surprise wedding for them. How many years ago? Eight years ago. It is their eighth anniversary, and this is the first song I played at the surprise wedding for John and Veronica. Oh my God, that was so much fun. It was up in, uh, uh, it was at the PAC in the ballroom, and that's where we learned dun 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 dun. Dun, dun, dun. Oh, yeah. Never gonna give you up. Yeah. Yeah. John and Veronica, I think they're from up in the Sheboygan area. They're from the Sheboygan area. They got married at the PA. Oh, eight years ago now. Damn it. Well, listen. I have always been responsible. I've always had a sense of obligation to God and the flag. To mom and apple pie. I, I don't know what's come over me. Don't know where it lies, this insanity. But I have to live at least once before I die. So tonight, I want to ruin my life. I want to throw it all away in a spectacular way. Something dumb, and I don't care. Bum, 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 bum. I can't remember the stupid dance that goes with that. Bum, bum, bum. Oh. Bo, you are never going to give up tonight, are you? I'm playing a guitar. I cannot throw the ball. Feel like I've been suffocating, hesitating, waiting for a moment when I even try to flap my weary arms and fly. I, I know I'll miss the family, miss the house, the dog, and the Jeep Cherokee, but I have to live at least once before I die. Throw it all away in a spectacular way. Tonight, I want to ruin my life. I want to do something. I'm transported right back to John and Veronica's wedding. Even though it's all up here in my imagination. And there's no such thing as John and Veronica. There's only me and the camera in, my, in Westview, New Jersey. And I, I'm, I 
know I'm Mr. Family, Mr. House, the dog, and the Jeep Cherokee. But I have to live at least once before I die. Are you with me? No, are you with me? Veronica, are you with me? So tonight, I want to ruin my life. I want to throw it all away. Way. Hey, hey. Tonight, I want to ruin my life. 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 And if I'm going down, you're coming with me. Out in lacrosse, there lives a multi tattooed man named Brian Simpson. Morning DJ and personality, former hockey announcer, professional bar slot machine player, married to Aresa. Brian normally just likes to listen to the metal. I think he might be the world's biggest Metallica fan, I'm not sure. Yet, sends me a text this week and wants me to play a very gentle song. Brian, the situation wouldn't be so sticky. This equation wouldn't be so tricky. You would love me if you weren't so picky, Anne Marie. You think that everything I do is amusing. I think that everything you say is confusing. It's that double talk you're always using. Anne Marie. Anne Marie. But you're still the one. You're still the one that I'll always love, no matter what. Still the one, you're still the one that I love. No ifs or ands or buts. There isn't any special time or season. There isn't any special rhyme or reason for your million little acts of treason. Anne Marie. Anne Marie. You're still the one, still the one that I'll always love, no matter what. You're still the one, you're still the one that I love, no ifs or ands or buts. The situation wouldn't be so sticky. This equation wouldn't be so tricky. You would love me if you weren't so picky. Anne Marie, Anne Marie, Anne Marie, Anne Marie, Anne Marie. Anne Marie. Next two songs also thematically linked. These are two songs about being batshit crazy. Hey, QAnon people, how you feeling today? Your boy is still in Florida, bellying up to the buffet. And I don't want to, I don't want to say anything, but I saw a little bit of the CPAC, C, C, the CPAP, the little CPAP, the breathing machine sleep. I saw a little bit of that speech. He looks oranger than ever. And that would be another great band name. Let's hear for Oranger Than Ever. Can we hear it for us? Wow. Yeah. yeah. The health of his skin is in definite jeopardy. Oh. 
I know that some of you out there still love the guy. Why? He never learned to, he never learned how to be president. I bet I bet he could have taken some lessons really quickly. He had a few months to do it. But listen, April out there in Las Vegas has not worked for a year. Because she's in the hospitality business. Maybe by the end of May, April, you'll be back at the at your gig. Shepherding rock stars. But until then, I will do any song you request. Including. Well, I can't think straight when you whisper in my ear. And I can't think straight if you shout. I can't think straight with your tongue in my mouth. But for God's sake, don't take it out. I can't think straight with you breathing down my neck with your breath so sultry and hot. I can't think straight when you're half undressed. Baby, I respect that a lot. Well, I can't think straight when I hear the accordions play my soft rock favorites. Just to hear the accordions always makes me lose my mind. So excuse me if I seem distant tonight And I just pick up my plate There's a whole lot of things I've been worrying about I can't think straight No, I can't think straight Guitar! When man began, all he needed to know was how to hunt, then how to get home. And it seems to me all our problems arose when mankind started to roam. Because our tiny little brains aren't equipped to comprehend all the stuff that we want them to. My tiny little brain is about to explode. There's not one damn thing I can do. Because I can't think straight when I hear the accordions play my soft rock favorites. Just to hear the accordions always makes me lose my mind. So excuse me if I can't make it tonight, or if I can and I'm terribly late. There's a whole lot of things I've been worrying about. I can't think straight. No, I can't. Think straight. I just can't think straight. Oh, I can't think straight. I just can't think straight. No, I can't think straight. I just can't think straight. No, I can't think straight. Joe Hip. This is the most complicated request I got this week. Thank you, Joe. I hear you went out to dinner with Kimmy and Kevin. Delightful company, aren't they? But I will say, Joe Hip, I'm still enjoying your bottle of whiskey, but the tasty cakes suck. All right, Steph. Sorry, Joe. I am doing your difficult request, though song about being a little mentally unhinged. How about you queuing on people? There's a voice in my head, and every night it speaks. It says I'm the one who normal, all the rest of you are freaks. But I don't know what I'm doing as it is half of the time, but I don't play, I guess. There's a pair of hands above me, and they're pulling all the strings, invisible to you. But to me, they're everything, because I don't know where I'm going until somebody starts showing me the way. Oh, yeah. And now I'm back on the train. Yes, I'm back on the train. And I'm back on my feet again. Just a little bit insane. Because I'm back on the train. 
been tested and retested. I've been prodded, probed, and poked. Took so much medication that I practically joked. I hooked up to machines and what the doctors did to me. I don't really know. And I don't care. I've been analyzed and tranquilized and hypnotized for years. Therapied and halfway housed, I cried a million tears. And all this time I knew I wasn't really very different from you out there. So now I'm back on the train. Yes, I'm back on the train. And I'm back on my feet again. I don't feel many pain. I'm back on the train I'm back in the swing I'm back in the middle of everything And I have no fear This time I'll make it out here Look at me! No, don't look at me! I'm back! I'm back on the train And I'm back on my feet again Back in the public domain Yes, I'm back on my feet again I hardly feel any pain Cause I'm back on my feet again I'm just a little insane Cause I'm back on the train You know how hard it was for to relearn that song? My brain isn't wired that way anymore, Joe Hip. I've been back on the train for years now. Back on the train singing. Ah, they're singing in the kitchen. Back is going to be on Jeopardy. Murph, is anybody watching our show tonight? How many we got? Oh. I guess that's enough. That's enough to do a show. Am I right or am I right? James Escalante. Thank you for donating to my show, James Escalante. And my, oh, did I already thank Michael Hanlon? I might have. John Santagata. John Santagata. See, we got some new names, but we have some old ones too. Stevens Patrick, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, I listen, listen, this is a great name. Annetta DeVette. Annetta. Annetta DeVette. Ariel Brath, I've, we've said your name before, Ariel. Catherine Wieland, or as they say in Germany, Wieland. Shelby and Mike out there in Madison. They're probably not watching tonight. Oh, they are? Shelby and Mike, in that case, hi. I miss our chats at the bar at that, sh I can't even remember the name of the bar now. Scotty Bar. I can't remember anything past, <laughs> when I go out to do my live show on the 17th, on St. Patrick's Day at Janesville at the Looking Glass, in a tent in the parking lot, it's my first live show since October. I'm not going to remember shit. I guarantee it. None of the shticks. I'm just going to do great song after great song. You guys will be like, oh, more, more, more. Yeah. Joe Hip will make, no, he will not make the set list. <laughs> if Joe Hip makes the set list, they'll be too hard. Carolyn Rosewall, Carolyn Rosewall, Aaron Master, Aaron Master, uh, uh, related to thigh, and <laughs> stare. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> stare and thigh and Aaron. Anya Bakuber wants me to say, Ethan Brodsky needs more sex and cider. Uh, Mary Beardsley Keller. Fireman Jim down there in Chicago. Hello, Fireman Jim. Julian's going to help turn the card. Kim Peterson. Thank you, Kim. 
Curtis Stumpfel. We said your name last week. I love it. There's a lot of consonants at the end of that name. Four of them. Four of them. Shelby Westover. Diane Bone, it's her birthday, but she has new hips. So Diane Bone's hips are only like a few months old, but her, her rest of her is older. Her hips are like a few days old. She's like a home. She's like the six million dollar woman, ladies and gentlemen. Bill Berger, thank you very much. Susan Klingman, like my song "Magnificent Noise." It was semi auto uh, Yeah, I'll do a little bit for you, Susan. I went to college, but I didn't learn a thing. Got a guitar and I attempted to sing. I hung around with all the rock and roll boys And I learned to make a magnificent noise Susan, I'll play that again for you. Rod Wilhelm out there in Colorado, thank you. And last but not least, Dave Halbrooks, who has a list of his 27 favorite Pat songs, and in the last 39 weeks, I have played each and every one of them. <laughs> Somebody needs goals. You need goals. Yes, Murph. Savannah got her, she was getting her vaccination and listening to her request tonight. Yes! Brian, I know she's no relation, but Cheryl Murphy requested this song a few weeks ago. Laura Wozniak, I don't know if she's any relation to our famous Wozniak. And Michael Finley requested this song. Now, I don't know if I'm going to do all the verses, but enough of them to get the flavor. I wish I had a monkey paw, I put it in my pocket. I'd like to buy some happiness, but no one seems to stock it. Sometimes I'm a tumbleweed, sometimes I'm a cactus. I'd like to teach the world to sing, but no one wants to practice. All right, out there, everyone. I wish I... There are problems in this world that I'm constantly stewing on. That's why I wear these Viking horns and believe in Q and I. That's not a real verse, I just made that up. The real verse goes, I crawl inside a turtle shell where nobody can find me. You can't escape reality. There's no need to remind me. I wish Yeah In England they call a wrench A spanner Maybe the last president should refrain From using so much self-tanner that's not the real verse. That's not the real verse. I just made that one up. The real verse is, if I was a Swedish fish, I would swim to Sweden. I love that godforsaken land. It's the closest thing to Eden. Two, three, four. After we finish the show every Friday, we start doing dirty dancing. And you would think I'd dance with the Mistress of Alcohol, but no, it's with ever handsome Kevin Hansen. I wish I had. Oh, that's not the real verse. That's not the real verse. I'm sorry, I just made that one up. The real verse goes I'd like to see the whole wide world. I'd like to go to China. I'd meet a pretty woman there and play with her computer. That's the real verse. I wish I had. Sometimes I'm industrious, sometimes I am lazy, and sometimes I sing campfire songs. It drives the ladies crazy. Oh, you know it. I 
wish I had a monkey paw. I put it in my pocket. I'd like to buy some happiness, but no one seems to stock it. Michael Finley, Michael Finley wanted me to do all the variations on a campfire song. So I guess I will. Starting with Gregorian chant. I wish I had a monkey paw. I put it in my pocket. Yeah, these are the shticks that I'll forget when I go play them again. How about uh, Memphis, Tennessee, 1956? I wish I had a monkey paw. I put it in my pocket. Uh, uh, Greenwich Village, 1962. I wish I had a monkey paw. I put it in my pocket. Reggae. I wish I had a monkey paw. I put it in my pocket, man. Thrash rock. I wish I had a monkey paw. I put it in my pocket. I wish I had a monkey paw. I'd put it in my pocket. So that's more, more like Paul Lynn. I wish I wish I had a monkey paw. <laughs> yeah. Everybody, all young people, all you young people who have never seen the match game for God's sake. Yeah. I think that's all the variations I can think of. Well, maybe, maybe we could all sing one very gently. Everybody. Wish I had a monkey paw. I'd put it in my pocket. I'd like to buy some happiness. But no one seems to stock it. Somebody yell out one, two, three. You get your hopes up. Sometimes they shatter. But in the long run, what does it matter? Don't let your troubles get you down. Don't let your struggles get you down. And above all things, don't let the small things get you down. You get your heart broke. Yes, it can happen. Oh, I believe it. You leave them laughing. Always a new day. Be thankful you've got one. There's always a new way. Until there's not one. So don't let your troubles get you down. Don't let your struggles get you down. And above all things, don't let the small things get you down. Don't let the crazies get you down. The wilted daisies get you down. And above all things, don't let the small things get you down. Don't let the morons get you down. The Trabadorians get you down. Above all things, don't let the small things get you down. Don't let the assholes get you down. Or John Dos Passos get you down. And above all things, don't let the small things get you down. Don't let the troubles get you down. Don't let your struggles get you down. And above all things, don't let the small things get you down. How many people we got watching this thing? That's enough. Don't you think that's enough? Yeah. One more gentle song for Todd Herrett. Spelled H E R D T. Todd. Todd. Another reference that no one's going to get. Why don't we just talk about shows from the 70s for the rest of the. Why don't we talk about who is, let's, do, let's throw some trivia out there. Who is the original host of Jeopardy? 
I said the word. The answer is, who is, oh, let me put it in the form of the original host of Jeopardy for 200, please. Who is Art Fleming? He was the first host of Jeopardy when the dollar values were 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60 per, yeah. Is. Get ready to match the stars for the big money match game. Where was I? Oh. One more gentle song for Todd Harrett. And then we're going to tear the roof off my house. Everybody smells like CK1. Everybody smells like CK1. Everybody smells like CK1. How am I supposed to get anything done? Oh, ye of little faith, Todd. Everybody looks like they're hooked on crack. Everybody looks like they're hooked on smack. Everybody looks like they're hooked on crack. Well, they were hooked on phonics just a few years back. Everybody wants to be my very best friend. I just want to be alone. Everybody acts like they've seen it all. Everybody acts like they know it all. Everybody acts like they've done it all. And that just ain't no fun at all. Afraid to die, everybody's so afraid to die. Everybody's so afraid to die. Well, guess what? So am I. Everybody wants to be my very best friend. I just want to be alone, alone. I just want to be alone, alone. I just want to be alone. Paul and Lara Marker. You ready to sing? Let's get let's get my background singers up here. Let's get Murphy. Let's get Murph up here. Who can Murph for tonight? Murph is portraying Ken Jennings. Murph as Ken Jennings. I'm taking the mic off. What about your other background singer? She's gonna need this. Oh, here she comes. Here she comes. The beauty of the beast. Yeah! Uh, now we're ready. Every dream I have is broken. Every bubble has been burst. Every ray of hope is faded. And things can't get much worse. <laughs> But this time, this time, next year, next year, I go down, I go down to the ocean, to the ocean jumping, jumping, and I'll float away. But this time, this time, next year, next year, I go down, I go down to the ocean, to the ocean jumping, jumping, and I'll float. Oh, the rain came down in buckets. 
pockets for 39 days and nights. The next day the sun was shining. I guess we'll be all right. This time, this time next year, next year I'll, go down I'll go down to the ocean, to the ocean jumping, jumping, and I'll float away. All right, Paul and Lara, let me hear you. This time, this time, next year, next year, I'll go down, I go down to the ocean, to the ocean jumping, jumping, and I'll float away. Cover me, find a brand new way of living and a change of scenery. This time, this time, next year, next year, I go down, I go down to the ocean, to the ocean jumping, jumping, and I'll float away. This time. Next year, next year, I go down, I go down to the ocean, to the ocean jumping, jumping, and I'll float away. Jumping, jumping, and I'll float away. I'm gonna Kimmy and Ken Jennings, ladies and gentlemen. All right, Kimmy, you're excused. Ken, you stay right here. Now let's have Murph play somebody else. How about Udo Dirk Schneider? <laughs> Murph is now Udo Dirk Schneider. And this is for Jonathan Addington. Jonathan Addington, thanks for the donation this week. And the, Andrea, I hope you're listening, Andrea. But this is from Jonathan to you. I may never have another night like this. In fact, I know I'll never have another night like this. It seems to me it could easily be all downhill from here. Just be lying wide awake there in my bed. Wind the vision in my head. But here we are together and we're out of our minds. I don't ever want the night to end. So I don't want to go. 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 Switch parts. Switch part. One, two, three, four. I don't want to go. I don't want to go. I don't want to go home. I don't want to go home. I said no. 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 No one can make me go back there. No. 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 No one can make me go back there now. I don't want to go, I don't want to go, I don't want to go home, I don't want to go home.
Don't tell them about it, man. Oh, oh, oh. Yeah, 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 yeah. Murphy, ladies and gentlemen, let's hear for Brian Murphy. And on a Friday night, Brian never wants to go home. He likes to stay at the McCurdy house. Oh, I'm sorry, that's George. I don't want to go home. I don't want to go home. I don't want to go home. Thank you, everybody, for watching tonight. Thank you for donating to these shows. Thanks for keeping me afloat. I'll be glad to play your request. I did, I don't know, 20-some of them tonight. Well, a couple of them I were put in there. Okay. One more time for Pipe and for the ever-handsome Kevin Hansen. Kimmy on, Kimmy Younger on vocals. Brian, I'll never forget you. St. Paul in his letter to the Ephesians. Said it came to me upon a midnight glare. He said, I finished writing all of my gospel. Now all I seem to want is sex and fear. Mark Antony looked down on Caesar's body. He said, friends, Romans, countrymen, lend me your ear. I come here to praise Caesar. I came here for sex and beer. Sex and beer. Sex and beer. Are the two things we hold dear. Sex and beer. Sex and beer. Are the things we like around here. Oh, the college boys back. George Washington, he never crossed the Delaware. There was no midnight ride with Paul Revere. Man Franklin never discovered electricity. They were too busy looking for sex and beer. Sex and beer. Sex and beer. Are the two things we hold dear. Sex and beer. Sex and beer. Are the things we like around here. You know what would make this perfect? If Miles would come down. Ah, he won't. But. Oh, yeah. Charles Dickens gave us great expectations. Shakespeare gave us Hamlet and King Lear. Dostoevsky gave us crime and punishment. Who the hell is going to give us? Sex and beer, sex and beer, sex and beer are the two things we hold dear. Sex and beer, sex and beer are the things we like around here. Oh, this is this is the perfect night for me. My whole family in front of me. Oh my God, I'm gonna get a little teary-eyed right now on show 39. 38 shows, I never got teary. Well, I got teary-eyed a couple times. This year, this week, I'm only teary-eyed about thinking about the governor of Texas. That guy makes me cry. But from the city to the suburbs to the country, get ready, you two. From the southern to the northern hemisphere, now holding a tremendous referendum. And F the McCurdy brothers. Sex and bear, sex and bear are the two things we hold. Sex and bear, sex and bear are the things we like around here. I, we forgot one brother down there. Now they could take away our pride, our dignity. They could use up all our blood and sweat and tears. They could take away our names and give us numbers, but they will never take away 
a sex and bear, sex and bear, sex and bear, are the two things we hold dear. Sex and bear, sex and bear, are the things we like around here. What do we like? We like sex and bear and sex and bear and sex and bear and sex. And I will see you next Friday night. And on St. Patrick's Day in Janesville at the Looking Glass. Thank you, everybody. Good night. How I really feel tonight, but I just might.